yeah, yeah I know. it's a what business. Is, what yeah. can you do? I and can that, do that, as much as I can do. <laughs> that's very true. Um, sometimes when it comes to business mm -hmm. or things that are, are, it depends on your priorities, right? Because yeah. many people live their lives. I don't care about business or work, and they just they just are floating drifting i call <laughs> drifting right right and and yes. they're very happy <laughs> or see. they think they are yeah they think they are right yes so and, you're... <laughs> yeah, yeah that, that that, yeah your background and and you in your head is just kind of like a hologram that's, hologram that's because, that's because my, it's a background uh yeah background thing so it looks like you're in a hologram. Oh yes, let's go ahead and 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 talk about that. You sent a uh, yeah a I sent on, you. on on the uh, on the other day. I sent and you, you. Were looking, now that one about the little girl looking behind the um, oh right yes. What are what are your thoughts on that, Shelby? I'm still exploring from all the information I receipt okay and okay. i recently tried something very interesting i wore my sunglasses but my sunglasses also it has some scratch it's not like a hard scratch it's just like lines you know or fingerprints that sort of line it's not a crack so i wearing it i i look up on directly to the sun in my car so there's another lake another layer of um you know how the car on the top windshield has an, another layer of uh, some tin sun tin layer okay anyway so i look on through look into the sun for for a couple seconds i believe and then i look away you know like put my head down and i can still see the I don't know how to describe it. The, the sunlight, the beams, you know, it has different light, line, light lines, right? And then I start seeing some, I don't know, from that, from the, from the, from the line, from the, should I say line from my sunglasses, mm -hmm. those lines turn into lines of, reflection wow. of the sunlight i don't know how to describe it you know just like that picture i sent you you know if you see a mac matrix yeah. Yeah. Like, but it's not numbers it's just like digital lines <laughs> it's no. very interesting and it's not green because my car's um that tent sun tent is blue so i saw blue and it's very funny. I I mean, very interesting. No. And then I know. put and then I put my hand in front of my eyes. That my hand is just like what your head looks like right now. It's see through, to, like a hologram. You know, my hand is not become like um, that. That whatever reflection is showing me is actually the physical form. My hand become. The hologram, you see, you see what I mean? If, mm. Yeah, it reverse. <laughs> Strange, mm. isn't it? My hand become a non-physical form. Now I know you said you're still researching it, but what yeah. was your initial reaction? Well, this is gonna be sound a little crazy because yeah, go ahead. It doesn't matter. Are we, are we are we being recorded? Yes, I sit there. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Right, I sit there in, in right in front of this um, clinic that my mom used to go. I took her there, and I'm just sitting in the parking lot to wait to meet with my mom. I mean, my sister and my dad for lunch. And then I, I just had a thought. All of a sudden, want to see my mom? <laughs> just strange thought. I just, uh, let oh. me let me see if I can see her th through different timeline. That's what I thought. Oh, so you, so you were already thinking something like that in a way. 
Yeah, so I sit in my car and I close my eyes and try to imagine and open to see if any different, no. But, but it's at that same time, because I've been practicing some meditation, uh, it's called alpha frequency. Mm -hmm. And the sound, like the you know, it provides sound in my in my in my headset. So when I every time I do that practice, and when I'm done, take my headset off. I'm very sensitive to surrounding sound. My oh. my hearing kind of just you know opens up, very different. Interesting. Yeah, so a little piece, little tiny, tiny sound I can become. Is I can this, hear. Um, remember the lines right there? Is that what you, what I received the other day? Yes, yeah, similar okay. to that. And it's, uh, right. like I said, it's blue color. It yeah. wasn't green, it was blue, right? I Yeah, I think, okay, you see the lines, right? Mm -hmm. And I, I believe the line is due to because my sunglasses has lines. Not crack, but okay. just scratch line. And then the color, because I look up and my car's uh, windshields, that top portion, the tent, sun tent portion is blue. Mm -hmm. Blue. So when I look and then come down, when I, I see something like that. Oh, okay. Okay. And then I put, like I mentioned, I put my hand in front of my eyes. Okay. That my hand become the like your head right now, <laughs> like a hologram. So you know, uh, two things come to my mind. You know how, or have you ever heard of that thing where the sky is not really blue; it's a different color. Yeah, right? yes. But we see it blue because of I forgot what the scientific reasoning was but you heard that principle right or that statement right i'm wondering if that code or that computer mm -hmm. thing you see is really not green or not blue right. I, I heard our eyes can only see well, like rainbow color right seven color mm -hmm. and there's more color beyond the well, color we can see well let's let's go a, a step deeper we all look at the sky and everyone on the earth will agree that's blue. But in reality, it's not blue. Yeah, it's a reflection of the ocean. But we will call it blue. Mm. But it's not blue. At nighttime, it's dark black. It's not blue. <laughs> but that, that's that's, that's why, that's see? Like right? Even yeah. though we all see it blue, it's not blue. Yeah. And 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 like earlier when I described the my eye become can see something, and at the same time I'm not just looking at one direction. I look around. I I look around inside that little reflection to see if I can see something or some things. Mm. <laughs> and okay, now now you just remind me of another analogy. Remember when you when we sometimes when we somebody take picture of us and it had flash right and all of a sudden your eyes has a blue ish thing right in front of you for a little a little sec few seconds right that's how I mm. reflect to the sun but it's a bigger bigger uh, how do you say bigger <laughs> reflection I guess from the wow. from the light. Okay, and what I was going through, where I was going to with that was to try to make a point. There's many points, so it's not just one thing. And I believe we had been texting back and forth and many things that have been going on were like, why does everybody hate each other? Uh, right? Yes. And... I believe, or I have, I have a sense that it could be that not everybody is seeing the same thing that we are seeing. Like you saw that that code there, or that matrix code, and then everyone's seeing the blue sky, but it's not. Well, one, they're seeing something that's not really blue, or they're seeing you saw the code, but no one else can see the code. And then let's go ahead and back it up. Remember that link I, I showed you or shared with you a few 
uh, days ago about where I, I sent you a YouTube video and it's from that movie where the guy puts on his glasses and he can see and then he takes them off and they're, it, everything looks normal. I think many times we see something that we think is normal mm -hmm. and another person sees something entirely different that's they think is normal but is not but we're looking at the same thing at the same time. Yes, I have learned there's two, maybe two possibility. One, it's more scientific, maybe not scientific, more science proof, new York science, meaning, um, let's say our everyone's past experience is different, right? Right. Right. And then, so when I look at certain things, it reminds me of my past experience of this thing. It's going to be different from yours because different past experience. Oh, let me let me throw a, a time <laughs> bomb in there. You're right. One so of the that, major excuses that we hear is when <laughs> we have people watching the same movie, but depending on your past, whether mm -hmm. it's career, your training, what you did when you were young, whatever. It's, right. you know, someone's going to look at the same movie but have a different take on it or different observations or different focus. Right. The other side of that is many times we have families who grew up in the same environment. Yeah. Are seeing the same thing just as experiencing the exact same moment, but they're yes. both or all three of them, depending on how big your family is, everyone sees something different. Yes, very, yes. very yes. true. And also, another second possibility is um, is 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 about how what we focus on in the present time. Let's yes. say um, the good analogy I learned from Tony Robbins is, um, let's say you're you 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 want to buy a a red car for example okay you're thinking about buying a red car red car and then all of a sudden when you go drive on the street you see a lot of red toyota camry because that's the one you want but see all of a sudden you're gonna appear all to you oh right? yeah but the thing is it's probably been there all this time you know your neighbor will have that car maybe months or years but you never pay attention because you're not looking right. So you never know until that moment, but it's like you said, it's always been there. Yeah. And that so, brings up my next topic. Remember I mentioned to you this group, I'm going to share my screen. Sure. The so-called organization. Where is it? This one here in the red, Orlando Templi Orientis. Yeah. Okay. So that's to the right. It's on Google. And I went ahead yeah. and searched and Hollywood. They also have a organization called Agape Lodge, uh -huh. which is a subcategory of this Orientist to the right. Okay. What I'm getting into with that is that's always been there. If you look at it, 1935 to nine, you know, so that's when it started. Mm -hmm. But this other one was back even further back than 1935 yeah right so, right and Did like i'm not that? i'm not familiar with that but like 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 you you just mentioned you know we have different background or knowledge information from the past experience so so that's why you know I, let's say i'm not very into the music band in the uh 60s 70s 80s part of 80s and i'm very familiar with the 80s 90s and early 2000 yes. so yeah so so same thing with i think with everything in our life right now it's it's um everybody has their own opinions per se yes. and it's all because um where we came from like <laughs> where we experience wow. When I, I don't, uh, yeah, like you and I, they you are, and I, there, there are certain things going on in the past, even today, that we have no idea are yeah. going on. 
that little article I just showed you, I had no idea it was there yesterday. And when I asked you, you didn't have an idea either, mm -hmm. which is fine. But what I'm trying to point out is that has been going on since 1930s. And because we're not in that business, we're not in Hollywood, or it's going on. Bang. You know what I mean? Yes. It's happening right now. And I'm going to show you a couple of names here. Another uh -huh. web page. Sure. Okay. Now see here. This one here. Forget mm. Scientology. This is another group that came on that was a subdivision mm -hmm. of the previous page I sent. A subcategory, I should say. Okay. And the reason I know is this, this, this name here, Alistair Crowley, we're going to have yeah. to go into this person a little bit more, but he's sure. the one who started the founder. And incidentally, the founder of Scientology and the founder, Alistair mm -hmm. Crowley, they knew each other. Oh. And if wow. you look down here at the bottom, other stars linked to the cult include Jimmy Page and Jay-Z. I you see, see that. I wanted to share with you some of the things where there are many things happening that we have no clue are happening. And the only reason I came across that name was yesterday. Mm -hmm. I was listening to another podcast that I'll have to send you the link on. However, the podcast was under the category of UFOs. Uh -huh. Okay. We'll have to talk yeah. about that later. Yeah, we'll talk about it later. The, the reason that she, the lady, and mm -hmm. I'll have to send you her, her link, was under UFOs was she was introduced to that Orientus cult when mm. she was younger because her mother was a member of that organization. Right. And so she grew up with it. While she was growing up with it, uh -huh. she was indicating to her it was normal. But then right. when she started seeing it and and experiencing what was really going on yeah she actually actually tried to step back from it wow but they almost ruined her life with some of the things that they did to her huh yeah and it, like that link you sent me from the instagram where that reporter went to the uh, tech right and then a few days later she just disappeared yes and yes. That yeah that that also because when we were talking about the you know everybody has different um opinions or different insights another thing if we talk about more like a ufo or that uh, mul multiple dimensions uh, yes <laughs> So a a might be I I don't know I I'm I guess I'm learning exploring into that that realm. So I somehow believe it can it, it might be true. You know, if I can see that little at the, another layer when I see the reflection of sun, then that can consider as a different dimension, right? Right. It just because we normally can't see. I'm wondering if that could be a layer that's artificially placed there for us to think that we are in a matrix, but we're not really in a matrix. Um, yeah. Or, or simulation. Yeah, we're not even in a simulation. Not the quite the way they want us to think we are. So, so that might be also leads to a person think one way and the others think different sure. way sure. maybe the, the dimension or layer is all mixed together you know you sure. heard of some of the historical hi, hi, historical moments some per some people remember it out, um at, at one way and the other is another way you know yeah. you yeah. yeah i think i sent you a link that i forgot the name of how it, it's called something in science where a whole population remembers something different yes. than what yes. directly happened. Yes. 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 And then we want to. I think the, the example I, I sent it that's in the article is uh, Nelson Mandela. They said he died in prison, but yes. he never did. Yes. He actually lived, right? But people yeah. remember yeah. that. Yes. Yeah. Very, very strange. 
Yeah, yeah. it's very strange. So that's why I think our world universe has a lot that we don't know yet. <laughs> Yeah. And then and then since you're big with the K, uh JFK tomorrow assassin? yes so and then he's yeah. all, also blend into UFOs moons you know all that so maybe next time when we talk we can go <laughs> from, come from JFK and see maybe the things you think you, it happens and maybe from another person it didn't happen <laughs> right well and the funny thing is that one of the things that i guess to sum it up what we're talking about yeah is um and you see it there things are not always what they seem to be yes right mm -hmm. and even going back to that picture i showed you about the young girl opening up the uh curtain mm -hmm. to me i was automatically reminded of the book alice in wonderland yes right Right. And that is her going into a simulation. Mm -hmm. and when you fell down, that's a simulation. And funny thing, when I was driving earlier this morning, I thought about that too. And then it has to do with the rabbit. Yes. Yes. The rabbit has the, the clock time. Now, now, the ironic part is that was written a long time ago. Before we were born, and and in the Chinese, um, one of the traditional story. I don't know if you heard you, uh, Moon Lady. Have you heard of the Moon Lady? Like the hour moon. If you look at it, the shadow parts looks like a rabbit too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. Oh yeah. And, oh yeah. And then a lot of things. A lot of time when we want to go deep into some, let's say, research or whatnot, we say, we go down to the rabbit hole. <laughs> mm, right? And, uh, yeah. and see, if you look back, how old is that story? I don't know. Right? And does anybody know? Thousands, thousands of years old. So yeah. what I'm getting at is human beings have known about this. They just didn't explain it the same way we we're talking about simulation matrix they had another word for it back then right yeah, falling yeah. into a hole uh, getting lost and like yeah if just reflection and you just i know. yes i really believe all the uh let's say disney or fairy tale movie, uh stories that we heard back in when we we're a child is our reflection all to that even peter pan's or Snow White, you see? Wake yeah. up and, you know. And now, I, I didn't want to bring it. It is very strange. Snow White took a bite of apple. Okay. <laughs> what do you think about that? Oh, yeah, right? And then this is the apple was, phone. Not and the first apple that was big. And then, <laughs> and then what happened to Snow White? Yeah. After she the, woke up. Uh -huh. So that's telling us something about yeah apple yes yes <laughs> oh i got you oh my You're god it up for all 30 no, seconds i didn't even see all it all over the place now yeah yeah <laughs> absolutely yeah. there's so many so. similarities that i like to i like to say and you, you probably got this from talking to me but history does repeat itself it really does yeah history well i think it's weird Somehow in the, in the I, I don't know how to describe it. Like, if we really look from a big picture, right? From a big picture, everything inside a big picture is happening the same thing as the outside big picture. And like, the, let's say we have, for example, we have uh, one, you know, 12 months, and then we have one month, and then we have 24 hours. And then we have 60 oh, seconds. You see what I mean? That's, that's, I mean? A, whole, that's a whole new. Uh, <laughs> you see what I mean? Look, look, at, look at my hand. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so yep. I believe oh. our our life or the cycle. What you what's, that, what's that? What's uh, that? 
where you find some another character inside another you take open it up and there's a smaller one inside oh yeah mm. maybe that is a direct i don't know the name yeah but you know what i'm talking about it it's yes. a giant bear or giant yes. animal, oh. <laughs> and then it just gets smaller and smaller but yes. i wonder if there's something that behind that because that's i think so there, right yes so it, logically if we take take that logic and we might be able to figure out the universe because it's just a bigger picture right the 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 what do you want to call it mathematic geometry it's just 10 times or 100 times bigger but this the the structure or the logic is the same even down to the particle but that way right Oh yes. Uh, well, yeah. See, not that I don't have anything in front of me right now, but uh, we can, yeah, we can that, continue. You know, the this. universe, the universe looks just like an atom. Yeah. Right. Yes. It, it has the same has the same characteristics and everything. It's like wow. Um, it's a cycle. So when you say the book is written thousands of years ago, it might be. The other way around, we haven't. <laughs> it will be written thousand years later. <laughs> yeah, uh, and that could be one in the same. Absolutely, I agree. Yeah. So I agree with that. So I really believe, even though it's Disney, it's fairy tale, even the genie. You oh, see, yeah. genie right now it reminds me of AI. You come in, you put a prompt, and it will tell you. <laughs> see. Yeah. Right? Yeah. All right. So we should continue our conversation yeah. for next time. Again, very soon. Thank you very much. Yes, for thank you. Off. I love this type of conversation. <laughs>